guys, welcome back to Rochelle's Creative Dishes, the Coastal Edition, okay? I am here on Dolphin Island, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to filet, actually butterfly a snapper, Chef Rochelle's way, okay? So let's get over here. Okay guys, so we have Dolphin the Snapper all the way from the Cab Farmer's Farmer's Market, okay? So let me show y'all, let me actually tell you guys why I'm just so like, interested in learning how to butterfly snapper, right? So I went to this restaurant in Houston. I had this Mediterranean butterfly snapper and I said, you know what? I'm going to get that technique down pat. Now, if this is my second time butterfly butterflying it. So that's why I'm saying we're going to butterfly it my way, but it's going to be right, okay? So I've already cleaned it. So when I had the scale, when I had the dolphin, I mean, when I had snapper, the snapper um, cleaned at the farmer's market, I made sure they clean all the scales and gutted it out. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and hold the snapper down like this, right? And so I'm gonna go ahead and just start making my way towards this tail. Cause it's already kind of filleted already, but I wanna just make sure that I'm not getting in, um, any bones in it. So what I'm going to do is butterfly it from the, let me show you guys right here. So it is a, like a spine right here. So you, what you wanna do is, okay guys, I told y'all I'm still new to this, so y'all, we gonna get it together, okay? So I'm just going to cut against the spine. All right, we gonna get this. I told y'all this Chef Rochelle's way now. Hold on, hold on. You know what I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna cut this head off. So we are gonna cut this head off. <laughs> this is hilarious, y'all, but this is my way until I learn it completely the right way, okay? Ah! All right. Dolphin giving me a hard time out here. <laughs> but this is the fun part about it. Like each time you're not going to get it right. So I know the people that are going to watch this are going to see that she's doing it wrong. But hey, you don't know if you're doing it wrong until you try, okay? So I'm just going to get this head out the way. And once I get the head out the way, I'm sure this is going to flow a little bit more smooth. Okay. All right, y'all. Say bye bye. Say Rochelle's Creative Dishes, period. Lavender lemon pepper, lavender occasion, and lavender sea salt. Bye bye. So we got that out the way. All right, so let me get these little other areas off. All right. So this is going to make it a little bit more easier. So I'm going to cut against the, the spine. Actually, you know what guys, I'm gonna move over to this little small paring knife because it is a lot of bones in here. And this may not be right the, the first time, but you know, the next time it's gonna be good. But it's going to taste good. halfway butterfly right here so what I need to do now is remove the middle part of this bone right here oh get away hey this is this is just what it is when you outside okay so nothing perfect oh, oh. <laughs> it's okay it is okay I'm not studying that fly that fly is not gonna hit dolphin I'm telling you that right now all right now that was super easy so you just wanna make sure that you got this bone out of the fish. So this is like the spine here, all right? So we're gonna just clean it up a little bit. See how easy that was? Now, it may not look that easy, and I know a lot of people probably are not going to do the work, but if you really love cooking and just wanna try different techniques when it comes down to different fish and stuff like that, why not try it? Why not head over to my page and let me show you how I did it my way, okay? Because this is a butterfly snapper right here. OK, 
Okay, and what we have here is a butterfly snapper, okay? So what I'm gonna do is add a little, just some lemon to it until I get it upstairs. And I'll see you guys on the next episode and I'll show you guys what I did to this butterfly snapper.